was it too much to ask? A wrinkle less here, a bag less there. Where are the bits that you'd, you'd like to see changes? Um, probably just about everywhere, but <laughs> mainly, um, I guess, fine lines and wrinkles. I'd like that to be like that. That would be quite nice. <laughs> For two months, Joss, Steph and Michelle have been pricked, prodded and pampered to find a way to get rid of those wrinkles without surgery or Botox. Now pull up. 48-year-old Joss took on the ultimate challenge. Wide open now. Slowly scrunch harder. Dr Ruth's facial fitness. 20 to 30 minutes of facial exercises a day. 44-year-old Steph had it easy. They say after four weeks the appearance of lines and wrinkles would be reduced by up to 50%. So. Sounds wonderful. Yeah. Boots number no. 7 beauty serum. We bought it in London. Supposedly, it's been scientifically proven to work. 50-year-old Michelle was pampered. How was that? Oh, was that then? Yeah. Oh, I didn't feel that. Facial acupuncture. The old Chinese method should improve muscle tone and stimulate blood supply. So what worked and what didn't? The wrinkles um, between my eyes have got this. Joss admits really it was hard doing the exercises every day and she got a bit slack as time went on. They take about 20 or 30 minutes to do and trying to do that every day, it became... I was really good for about the first month then it got quite difficult after that. Still, she thinks there's a difference. Mostly um, in the lines that were just between my eyes. I'd say that's the, probably the biggest difference and on my forehead and also I do think Around my mouth, it's just a little bit softer. Let's have a look at before and after. Well, those are definitely different, yeah, aren't they? Yeah, that's a huge difference. You had quite a furrow there, yeah, and it yeah. doesn't seem to be there really at all. It's just a tiny good. line. Yeah, I think it's gone. The other thing I'm noticing is that when I wake up in the morning, I'm not waking up with sort of squashed up morning face. So much, <laughs> if that makes sense. So definite improvement for Joss. It's the old adage, the more effort you put in, the better the results. Next up, Steph. She had the Wonder Serum. So we're less wrinkly, do you think? Well, I'm not too sure about that, but the product was beautiful to use. Definitely lovely to apply to my skin. Before and after shows there are no dramatic changes, but Steph feels her skin is better. Through here looks maybe slightly less prominent. Yes, absolutely. And also I've noticed a difference in my sunspots as well. They don't seem to be quite so prominent either. OK. And finally, did acupuncture work for Michelle? Definitely the skin tone um, has improved. I think there's definitely some reduction in the lines around my eyes. And I think that these little wee jowly bits have got better. <laughs> She's been having needles and Cleopatra magnets once, sometimes twice a week. And there are definite changes. This hair has definitely improved. It really has, hasn't it? Yeah, it has. If you look at that, you definitely look younger, I think. Yeah, no, I think you're right. So let's get down to the nitty gritty. For Steph's serum, you'd pay about $33. It didn't make a lot of difference on the wrinkles, but improved skin tone. Definitely be interested in continuing to use it because um, I have had comments as well from other people saying that they've um, noticed a change in my appearance, <laughs> which is lovely. You'd pay $106 for Dr Ruth's facial fitness kit, including postage. It's tightened Joss's chin and reduced wrinkles, but takes time and effort. The um, forehead, and I think that's made a huge difference, so I'll probably keep on doing those, because they're easy as well, and I can actually sit at work with my finger between my eyes and just... Finally, the acupuncture. Um, Depending on what you get done, a course will cost between $1,000 and $1,500. One of the major changes, obviously, is more tone um, in the neck and the jowls. Reduced lines around the under eyes. Um, reduced depth of wrinkles on the forehead. And just overall um, brightness in the complexion. Michelle plans to get a top-up treatment every few months. She's got a great base to begin with. I mean, if we had someone with a really hard weathered skin, like a sun-damaged skin, you'd see much more of a, a dramatic effect in terms of the quality of the skin. So no miracle cures, but proof you can improve your wrinkles without turning to the scalpel.